Hey folks, Lolo Loco here, and welcome back to Inktober 2017, day two. Shut up, I know it's late. I'm, I'm getting there. I'm, I'm doing my best. The prompt for day two is either pumpkin or hurt, and I thought to myself, I really don't want to hurt anyone, let alone a pumpkin. The poor buggers have been through enough already. I mean, they already get cut open and disemboweled once a year, like, let's give them a break from the pain, okay? <laughs> well then, I thought, what is the opposite of pain? Anime. I have no explanation, like, <laughs> your guess is as good as mine, I just thought of pumpkin heads and then the Headless Horseman. And instead of drawing something cool, like the Headless Horseman, I thought, oh, hey, what if instead of this amazingly terrifying and chilling villain, this pumpkin head was some kind of schoolgirl? And also she has a witch's hat, because... I don't know. Maybe there's an event going on at her school, and finally, it's her time to shine. Like, oh, wow, usually I don't stand out at all. Somehow, despite literally having a pumpkin for a head. B but now that our class is doing a haunted house for our school's Halloween festival, I can finally stand out and use the skills I was born with to make sure we win the festival, because now it's also a competition for some reason, and maybe then Senpai will finally notice me! Like, I'd watch that anime. <laughs> I mean, I'm happy with it. You know, it's cute, it's it's dumb, but it was a lot of fun to draw. And, you know, I had to make the outline of this piece much thicker than the rest of it because of the background, and I debated for a bit if I should leave the bats white and colour in the rest instead, but in the end, I just coloured in the bats. Partly, you know, because I'm lazy, and partly I just thought the bats would look better if they were silhouettes, like, all shaded in. I liked how it looked. Also, I still need to buy a rubber. I, I'm still wasting the one on the end of the pencil. I, I mean, I, I got the old one and I just snapped it in half and used the bits that weren't old and rubbish. Still rubbish, though. <laughs> But yeah, this one was simpler and sillier than the first one, but I still love how it ended up. And, you know, that's day two. Done. It, it took a lot less time as well. So, you know, so far I'm still going strong. Still late, but still strong. Better late than never. I'll see you tomorrow for the next one. Um, I'll put the prompt list that I'm using down in the description, so please check that out because it's a really nice prompt list. And yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you're having a lovely time wherever you are. Stay safe. Ta-da!